Want to score some free loot in Sea of Thieves? I'll show you how to unlock free items in Sea of Thieves without spending a single penny. So, here's how you do it. So, did you know you can get free in-game items for Sea of Thieves with the Xbox Game Pass Ultimate? Now, please note the standard Xbox Game Pass doesn't include these perks. Past rewards have included the Royal Portrait Pack and also the Heroic Hunter Pack as well. Now, the way I found my codes have been through a message from Xbox on the actual Xbox Game Pass itself, but there is also another way to check and how to do this will be in the description of the video. Now, you do need to be sure to claim these before the deadline because they do expire and to be fair, they are often replaced with new items. So it's very handy to keep an eye out for because who doesn't like free rewards, right? Now, CFEs do like to give away free items from the pipe podium itself. And if I'm totally honest, I do believe majority of my emotes have actually been claimed from the free giveaways from the Pi Emporium. I mean, I don't really use emotes, but it's free stuff, right? So can't really complain there. So how do you find these? Well, it's very simple. Just head to the Pi Emporium and then all you need to do is just locate the free cosmetics. These are often highlighted as a limited time buys. So it's definitely worth checking every so often and coming back, especially in a new season. Also, while you are there, you might as well check out the discounted items, especially with the free ancient coins that you got from the seasonal rewards. Now, if you're someone like me who prefers YouTube content to streamers, well, you might be missing out on the free stream drops that you can get for Sea of Thieves. Yep, that's right. You can get free items in the game just by watching a streamer play Sea of Thieves. How awesome is that? Not only do you get a free item, you also support the streamer, so it's a win-win situation. First, you will need to link your CFEs account to your Twitch account by visiting the CFEs website and following the account link in instructions. The link will be in the description below. All you'll need to do now is watch for the correct time frame, and then once it's been unlocked, you click claim and the cosmetic is all yours. But if you are having fun watching the streamer, you might as well just stay around. Twitch Drops is also where I got my Ebon Flinklock Pistol, so yeah, that's pretty cool, not gonna lie. Another way to get free rewards inside Sea of Thieves is just by playing the game. Yep, that's right, there's something called Seasonal Rewards. Now, I'm sure 90% of you understand what Seasonal Rewards are, but I am guarantee you there are some people out there who have no idea what these are. So, in summary, all you need to do is just play the game, as you would do. From there, what are you going to do is you're going to progress in the seasonal rewards bar. And as you can see, there's a lot of cosmetics that you can unlock just by progressing in the game. Now, you may have noticed, though, on the seasonal rewards, there are a few rewards that are locked and some of them are, you know, really, really cool. You will need to buy the plunder pass for this one. So if I'm honest, I would only advise doing it if you really wanted a cosmetic. Otherwise, I don't see the beneficial towards this. These have been the ways that I have managed to get free items and cosmetics in Sea Thieves over the years. Now, uh, if you have uh, any other ways that you get free items, uh, kind of share the secrets in the comments below.